This is the McConkie plate. This is also a selective and differential media. Uh, because of certain dyes that are placed in the media, gram positives will not grow on these plates, only gram negatives. So on this plate, this is what it originally looked like. I did inoculate with Staphylococcus aureus, and as you can see, there is no growth. Sorry, I'll turn the label around. Um, so this is what the plate looked like initially. Over here, we inoculate it with Enterobacter orogenes. As you can see, we did get growth. And the colonies are pink. That is indicative of a lactose fermenter. So Enterobacter orogenes is a gram-negative organism. As well as on this plate, which I inoculated with Pseudomonas aeruginosa, where I got the good growth on the plate, you can see the colonies are yellow. Yellow means negative, that is not a lactose fermenter. So these two plates, you had gram negatives grow. You did not with the gram positive, that's selective. Differential, you can see the difference in colors between the Enterobacter orogenes over here, which is pink, which would be positive, versus the yellow over here, which would be negative for the Pseudomonas originosa.